What it do, it's your boy Ada. Welcome back to the channel. I recently went to Disneyland Resort. Um, I love all the souvenirs that they have during the Christmas holiday. I love the new foods that they debut. And of course, seeing the tree on Main Street. My family makes it a point to try to go every year during the holiday season so we can enjoy these things. And this year, I figured I would try some of the new foods and kind of share them with y'all. Join me, we're gonna go through a couple different clips. So I'll try to recap it by park first. Starting with Disneyland, one of the things that I was really looking for was the musical popcorn bucket. Wind it. We also went to Tropical Hideaway and we had a Holiday Dole Whip and then also the Lumpia. We had the Pork Lumpia and also the Sweet Lumpia this time. And then that was really good. I, I enjoyed that. I enjoy that every time, um, as long as it's not too greasy. The Holiday Dole Whip was good. It was cherry and lime mix. Um, the lime was good, but the cherry was a little bit off. But it looked really cool and it looked really festive. We actually ate that over by Bingo Barbecue. I love to go to Bingo Barbecue and get their skewers. We went on the Haunted Mansion holiday and then also got to meet Jack and Sally, which was really cool. And we had our special, actually, custom flannels. Um, so that was awesome and, and they liked those. They liked the way we were stitched up. I think the food highlight for me though was actually in Galaxy's Edge. We went to Docking Bay 7 and we had a few different items from there that were really bomb. Uh, it's got the noodle, the meat, and the green, green sauce. I was excited about the green sauce. Let's oh, try God. to get a little bit of it. Yeah. Yeah. The bantha beef. Yeah. He's doing that right. Yeah. He's like, this is pretty good. I don't know what this part is. The green is spicy, but not and the bean is very tender. This is seven out of eight for sure. This is definitely really? by the end. The yob shrimp mixed stew with swamp greens. I think these are the swamp greens down there. You got the shrimp, you got the sausage, the peppers, and the rice. I'm gonna take a little bit of everything. This one's good. They're all like in bed. There's a lot of gross. Space jump behind them. They got it. This is good. We also tried a Destrin ice cap, which was like this uh, this Sprite drink with a, a cream cheese topping. <laughs> oh, it's better if you drink it through the top. It's pretty good. And then also while we were walking through the marketplace of Batu, we did try a corn pie, which was pretty bomb. All right, here goes nothing. Mushroom. It's like an empanada. It's like an empanada. I didn't get too much ingredients, but it tastes good. But yeah, definitely a lot of food, a lot of eating at Disneyland. We actually ended our night off at Blue Bayou where we got the gumbo, which is always good. And then we got a pork shake and then we got creme brulee as well. So we were eating really well there. On the DCA side, um, we had a lot of fun. There we actually saw some street shows, Viva Navidad, which is my favorite. We were able to meet Max. We saw Mr. Fredericks in there too, which was a cool um, cool character to see. I'd never seen him in person. Over at Bodine's, we did try the chicken tortilla soup in a bread bowl, and it wasn't the best. Honestly, I was expecting a little bit more, but we did get a pull apart bread, which is awesome. You know, I love, I love bread, love sourdough bread. So I did try a drink at the Taste Pilots Grill, and um, I really liked that too. It was a holiday punch. Let's see. Got a little co-pilot over here. And my co-pilot <laughs> thought it was juice. <laughs> um, this is good. Um, definitely drinkable. Not too sweet. We did go to the Magic Key Terrace and we were able to try these um, cork sliders. It was called the Three Little Sliders and there was one for each of the Three Little Pigs. In Tomorrowland, we did try a Holiday Punch too that was really good with the cranberries. And the cranberries were really tart to actually eat them, but the drink oh, wow. itself was really good. That's actually really good. I think that sums up most of the big items, most of the Christmas time items that we were able to try while we were there for the holiday season. Kind of finished things out with the parade, got to see Santa during the parade, and then um, got our nice picture by the Christmas tree in our Christmas jammies at the end of the night. That was my recap of our holiday foods we tried at Disneyland this season. Let me know which ones you would like to try or which ones look good to you. Thank you for stopping by the channel. Thank you for checking out this video. Hope to see you next time and until then, a dub out.